Welcome to Patterson Mill High School for the 2020 All-County Chorus, oh my goodness, this is not chorus concerts, jazz concerts. I am Jeffrey Winfield, the Supervisor of Fine Arts for Harford County Public Schools. I would like to take some time to thank all who have helped to make this concert process run smoothly. The Patterson Mill High School Administration, Dr. Sean Abel, Principal for the use of their school, the music teachers, Ms. Fatima Peterson and Mr. Ron Burke for being our amazing hosts, the custodians who have been so very helpful to us throughout the entire process, Jeremy Green, the HCPS Office of Technology um, Liaison who is making an audio recording of our concerts today, the team from Harford Cable Network for producing a video recording along with live streaming on Facebook. Please join me in a round of applause to show our appreciation to those individuals. My sincere thanks goes to the dedicated professionals who teach these students and spend hours coaching and supporting them through, from the audition process to rehearsals and finally the concert. Thank you so much, teachers. <laughs> finally, I would like to thank you, all of the parents, guardians, fan, family, friends, and um, all of you for these talented students, for getting them here and supporting them in acquiring a well-rounded education in the arts. Thanks to all of you. You can applaud for yourself. <laughs> Marianne Pasolak is a Howard, oh my goodness, it's been a long day, Harford County native who taught vocal music in Harford County Public Schools for 28 years before retiring in 2018. She has been an adjunct faculty member at Harford Community College since 1983, having taught class piano, applied commercial voice, chamber singers, and an a cappella choir before taking over instruction of the Vocal Jazz Ensemble in 1998, which she still directs. I encourage you to read the rest of her bio in our program. Supporting the high school all-county jazz ensemble at the piano is Ms. Terry Matthews, on the drums, Mr. Drew Lawhorn, and on the bass, Mr. Joe Lusmore. Please join me in welcoming Ms. Marianne Pasolak and the 2020 All-County Jazz Choir.
Let's go and take a chair from our featured Julie Pineapple and Anthony Pedroza on the solos. The nice old tune, we're trying to mix a little bit of the older and the newer tunes. So our next piece that's been really great is a New York Voices piece that was written by Dale Walker, which we're going to learn again. Um, our our solos for this piece will be Shining Up.
Our next selection, uh, even though the title is in Portuguese, Minha Alma, is in English, so you'll be able to understand it. Um, we have two improvisation solos in this, and improvisation for voice is a little different than it is for instruments. It, it, when you're using an instrument, you look at the chord changes and you play the notes within it. But unless you are really well versed in your music theory with the doing vocal improvisation for the first time, you just have to listen to the notes and find notes that work with it. So our two soloists this song will be Alicia Selgin and Brendan Gray.
Okay, we're gonna pick up the pace a little bit with an, a little swing tune called Cherry. And our soloists will be Elizabeth and Brendan Hester. Before we do our last two tunes, I would like to say a special thank you to Mr. Jeffrey Winfield for giving me the opportunity to work with these fantastic kids. I had a blast, I really did. Um, and they seem to be well prepared and are really enjoying it or else they're fooling me. But anyway, um, and thanks to Fatima Peterson and Ron Burke for um, being our hosts here. Um, Goodbye Love is a very beautiful a cappella ballad. And then we will be ending with a Latin piece called Full Moon. And the soloists on that will be Mason Piot, Alyssa Vins, Julie Pencil, and Brendan Gray.
The sun is red and hazy when it's setting in the sky and the wind sings in a whisper like a lazy lullaby and you feel a strange sensation like the changing of the tide it's just the magic of the full
It's just the magic of the full moon. Ba, ba, ba. Welcome to the second half of our All County Jazz Ensemble concert. We have a student on the stage who has attained the honor of being in the 2020 All County All State Instrumental Jazz Ensemble. Nathan Hott, will you please stand? Congratulations and thank you for being our representative at the state level. Thank you, Nathan. Bassist, composer, and performer and teacher, Miles Brown, comes from a musical family and began playing the bass at an early age. He attended the Eastman School of Music for his undergraduate degree, earning a Bachelor of Music in Music Education and Jazz and Contemporary Media. He was an overachiever. In 2003, he received a Master of Music in String Bass Performance from Manus College of Music and earned a Doctorate of Jazz Performance from Eastman again in 2012. I encourage you to read the rest of his bio in our program. Miss Emily Seacrest will be joining us on the flute for several tunes. She is a student here at, uh, where are we? <laughs> Patterson Mill High School. Please join me in welcoming Dr. Miles Brown and the 2020 All-County Instrumental Jazz Ensemble. Thank you. 
Thank, thank you very much, everybody. That featured Gabe Cardella on the alto saxophone. And also Adam Richardson on the drum set. My name is Miles Brown. I'm the bass professor at the Universi University of Delaware, and I'm very honored to be here tonight uh, uh, with this wonderful group of musicians. Um, I have to say that when we first started rehearsing about three or four days ago, I came in, and uh, when we do these uh, all-county things, uh, you never know what to expect. I was literally blown away by how amazing they sounded from note one on day one of rehearsal. So give them a big round of applause. And that's a testament to not only their musicianship, but also their teachers and the, uh, and, and the whole uh, Hartford County music system. So please give them a big uh, round of applause to Mr. Jeffrey Winfield, too. Thank you very much. That was one of my favorite tunes uh, made famous by the Adderley brothers, Nat and Cannonball Adderley, called Janine. Uh, we're going to continue with a couple more tunes for you tonight. We actually have a change in the order of the program. The next piece we're going to do is written by one of my mentors. He was my, uh, my main professor at Eastman School of Music when I was a freshman uh, in college, uh, Mr. Fred Sturm. And I always loved his writing. He, he wrote very well for, uh, for uh, uh, developing improvisers. And this is one of his most famous compositions. It's a really beautiful piece entitled Riverscape. This features, features uh, Jason Caff on the piano and Gabe Cardella again on the alto saxophone. Thank you. 
Thank you very much. We're going to do a quick tech change out real uh, very fast uh, while I introduce the next tune. The next tune is written by uh, one of my favorite saxophonists and band leaders and composers, Bob Mincer. Um, I'm going to butcher the, the name of the title. I can never, I've played this piece a number of times before. Every single time I've played it, I've always butchered the name of the title, but I love the tune so much, so I keep bringing it back despite my difficulties with it. Um, I'm going to call it El Cabaro Heno. Uh, it's a great, uh, fun piece, and it's going to feature uh, four of our musicians today. And those are Dawson Reed on trumpet. Raise your hand, Dawson. Isaac Bacam on tenor saxophone. Caleb, uh, Caleb Atha on trombone. And finally, if we have guitar, do we have the amp working? It's working. It's working. All right, yeah, the amp is working. So we're going to have uh, Brandon Bourne on guitar for the solo for this. So please enjoy El Cabaro Heno. Thank you. 
Dawson on, Dawson on the trumpet. Caleb on the trombone. Isaac on the tenor saxophone. Brandon on the guitar. We're going to feature Caleb on trombone again on one of my favorite ballads written by the, um, the great jazz singer Billie Holiday. Uh, this is entitled God Bless the Child. say this also features not only Caleb on the trombone, but our entire fabulous trombone section. Tr trombone section, stand up. Actually, the brass too, the trumpet, doesn't it? Yeah. This is kind of like a brass feature.
Give it up for Caleb Atha in the trombone section. The last two tunes of the, that you have on your program, we're actually going to switch. Uh, for the reason of, uh, on, for the tune on Gears, we're going to get a chance to hear everybody take an improvised solo. Before we do that, though, we're going to play one of my favorite uh, Thad Jones uh, arrangements of, of all time. Thad Jones, of course, a, a luminary in the big band world, also from uh, Pontiac, Michigan, which is where I moved uh, uh, from to Maryland just a few years ago. So. Uh, I always try to give uh, uh, give homage to uh, to Thad and and the Jones brothers and the Detroit jazz lineage because it made a big impact on me, um, and these guys are are just they're killing this this tune. So I hope you enjoy. Don't get sassy. This also features. Got to tell you who the soloists are. This is Jason Calf on the piano again, right up front. Uh, Elijah Doyle on trumpet, and Isaac Backham on tenor saxophone again.
Thank you, thank you very much. We're going to close with one of my favorite uh, funk tunes. I want to thank Mr. Jeffrey Winfield for having me and for everyone here at Hartford County. It, I had such a good time. Um, it was really amazing to see uh, as, as much as they were so prepared on the first day, they all came a long way. Everyone got a ch little chance to work on some improvisation, including our flutist, Emily, um, and uh, who's going to join us on this last one. And uh, just thank you very much. It was an honor, and I hope to be back again uh, sometime in the future. So please enjoy this arrangement of Gears.
the Harford All County Jazz Band. Thank you, everyone, for, for listening and coming tonight. Good evening. <laughs>